Hello, everybody, and welcome to In Context with Jim Green. It's a special edition tonight. Uh, actually, this, uh, this is a, a milestone for uh, uh, my, this show. Uh, this is our first, my first moderated debate right here, um, and we are going to have a good time here. We have um, two teams. We've got two teams of brothers that will be debating tonight under the uh, the topic, the heart of the matter, how can one be saved? So we'd just like to say welcome to all of you who uh, took time out of your busy schedule tonight to join us. We appreciate everybody that's in the chat. Thank you very much. Um, <clears throat> if you would, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Uh, um, there's lots of great content here on this, this, uh, uh, this YouTube channel, Facebook, wherever you are. Uh, a lot of biblical content, so I'm pretty sure that you will be blessed with what you hear here tonight. Speaking of, we got two teams, very passionate brothers that love the Lord and love the Word of God, and they decided let's get together and um, let's have a little discussion, you know, and, and and let's get to the heart of the matter. So they decided to name it that, so that's what we're going to do uh, tonight. So, uh let me introduce two to the brothers, the brothers, or, or shall I say, let the brothers introduce themselves? Because is that not what we what we decided to do, brothers? Yes. Yeah. Okay, yeah. let's do that. So, so uh, let's go around the room. We have two teams. We have Travis Travis Thomas with Montrose uh, Church of Christ, and we have Paul Mays with Westside Church of Christ. And on the other team, we have Landon Thurman and Jason Osborne, both from testimonies of God. So let's start with Travis Thomas. Go ahead and introduce yourself, my brother. And also, um, if we wanted to, if someone wanted to find you on social media, go ahead and get that information as well. Okay. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining uh, tonight on this live discussion that we're going to have about uh, how is someone saved. Uh, of course, my name is Travis Thomas. I do Truth With Proof, and that's why Truth With Proof is on there, Truth With Proof on YouTube. I'm just a Christian. I'm a member of the Church of Christ. Um, let's see, I served in the United States Army for five and a half years. I have a bachelor's degree in criminal justice. I'm married. I have three wonderful children. And I just love the Lord. And I want people to go to heaven. And I want them to search the Bible, search the word, and come to the knowledge of the truth. John 8, 31, 32. Awesome, awesome. So how, how can we find you if we were looking for you? Well, uh, it's on Truth With Proof on YouTube. So if you just type okay. in Truth With Proof on YouTube, and right. not only that, I put my own phone, phone number out there. So, like, I love okay. so, so much. Like, if you want to study, you live in a different state, or if you live local in Middle Tennessee, you can reach me even by my phone number. Yes, sir. That That's awesome, man. And I'm, I'm glad to hear that because, I mean, ultimately it's about souls. You know what I'm saying? So it's good to hear mm -hmm. that. Brother Paul Mays. Yes. You're up, brother. Greetings, friends and brethren. Paul Mays with you. I'm a Christian. Just a Christian. No prefix, no suffix, no substitutions. I'm just a Christian. Added by Jesus to the one church we can all read about in the Bible. Acts 11, 26. The disciples were called Christians first at Antioch. Acts 4, 12. There is no other name. That's what I am. I'm, I live my life to glorify God. I love you, listener in a let's go to heaven together kind of way. That's why I do what I do. I'll look, I want to go to heaven and I want you to go. And I want you to test me. I do not want you to take me at my word at face value. Do not believe anything I say without opening your Bible and proving all things first. First Thessalonians 5, 21, test everybody here. And if anybody doesn't want to be tested by you, you can't trust them, okay? You open your Bible. This is your soul we're talking about here. So you have to be careful with that. I'm a Christian. I, I'm married. I have a lovely wife, two lovely kids. I live in Roanoke, Virginia, down in a valley surrounded by mountains, and I've got chickens and ducks, and I work my tail off. I, I travel, and I hold singing, preaching, revival meetings every month where I preach the doctrine of Christ in song form. I'm a hymnist. I write sermons in song form. Um, you can find my work on YouTube, Paul Mays Acapella Hymns dot and Paul Mays Acapella Hymns on Facebook and YouTube, and then I have PaulMaysHymns.com as well. I've got yes, a playlist that rolls constantly of, of original acapella teaching hymns. 
Yes, sir. Praise God. Praise God, bro. It's good to hear that, man. And also, you guys, as you guys are giving your information, if you want to go in the chat yourself and put a link in the chat, you can do that, too. So people can, like, find you, like, right now. Like, a movie, you know what I'm saying? So go ahead. Go ahead and do that at your leisure. <clears throat> so, um, so let's see. Uh, next up is Testimonies of God, Mr. Landon Thurman. All go, right. Sir. Yeah, thank you all for uh, coming in and joining live. Uh, I'm Landon Thurman, founder, president, full-time missionary with Testimonies of God. Uh, married to my beautiful wife. We've got two amazing bo young boys. Uh, we currently live here in Los Angeles County. Uh, came to Christ July 11th of 2020. And our ministry, we're also located in Dallas, Texas. That's where Jason is. And Springboro, Ohio, uh, with another brother there. That's part of our ministry. And our mission is about advancing the gospel of Jesus Christ. Um, that's what it's all about. And it's about equipping, and, and we want to equip the saints to effectively, biblically, and uh, confidently share their faith with the lost. As it says in Romans 1, 16, for I'm not ashamed of the gospel, for it is the power of God for salvation to everyone who believes, uh, to the Jew first and also the Greek. And so uh, we also do apologetic studies on how to defend your faith against false false faiths, false, uh, false religions, false gospels. And uh, we've got tons of resources on, on different faith backgrounds to help you contend for the faith. Um, so, uh, yeah, just go ahead and check us out at testimoniesofgod.org. I want to thank everyone tuning in. Um, thank you, Brother Jim Green, for moderating this event for us. And then also Travis and Paul, thank you guys for allowing us this opportunity to uh, just have this discussion on, on this important matter on, on how one can be saved. Yes, sir. And so to God, all, to God, all the glory. Yes, sir. Absolutely, absolutely, yeah. and um, uh, we, we're glad to have you, man. Glad to have you guys, and also uh, Jason Osborne, my brother, my brother Jason, you are up, my brother. Thank you, Jim. Uh, first and foremost, I just want to give glory to God. Uh, undeserving I am to be here to partake in this uh, opportunity to defend the faith, uh, just as I was undeserving for my salvation, but because of God's mercy and his grace, I am where I am today and I am who I am today. My identity is in Christ and it is my life that I live for him. Um, uh, I want to thank my brother Jim Green for moderating this debate. Um, and I want to thank Paul and Travis for uh, uh, joining in with us so that we can uh, dig down into what the scripture says and uh, by God's grace, find the truth uh, separated from error. And then so for all the listeners here as well, um, so that they can come closer to God in whatever that way that looks like. Um, so I thank the listeners for joining in. Uh, for me personally, I'm uh, I'm a dad uh, of three girls. Um, uh, I'm married to my beautiful wife, Cassie. Uh, I live in Roy City, Texas. Uh, and as you have heard, I'm part of Testimonies of God. And if you want to if you want to find me, I don't have my own personal YouTube or anything like that, but I am uh, on the platform of Testimonies of God. You can find us on Instagram, uh, YouTube, and Facebook, and uh, maybe some other platforms as well. But other than that, you're going to find me out on the street sharing the truth. So, um, again, it's a privilege to be here. So um, let's get into it. Amen, amen, amen. Sounds good. Sounds good. So people in the chat, we appreciate you. Don't forget, like I said, if you haven't already did so, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. We have lots of good content here. And also, I just want to give a shout out to my, my Cross Media Brothers apologetic group that I'm a part of, uh, Mr. Walsh, who's in the chat. You guys go ahead and follow him as well. Um, and also, Minister Chris, War and Worship, he's in the chat. Follow him as well for some good, good uh, content, as well as um, I think I saw Reginald Wells. Reginald Wells from Immersion. Um, also follow him as well as uh, the debaters have also to begin to drop their links. I'm seeing them dropping their links. I've seen Testimony of God. So um, we, we always want to be surrounded by good content, good Christian content, preaching, apologetics, all that kind of stuff. So, uh, okay, so <clears throat> let's, uh, like I said, we, we determined uh, uh, at the uh, beginning that um, oh, let me give you guys the format first. Let me do the form formats first. So here, this is what we're going to do, guys. So um, the format is uh, going to go like this. Is going to be um, opening statements. Uh, each team is going to have 20 minutes to do their opening statements. 
And after the opening statement, the opposing team is going to have a rebuttal of 15 minutes. Uh, so we're going to have back and forth there. And then when we're done with the, uh, the opening statements and the rebuttals, we go into the cross-examination round. That's when the teams actually get to ask each other questions. And so on that, that's going to be 20 minutes uh, uh, of time allotment there. So one minute max to ask the questions, two minutes to, um, to answer the question. And then after that, we will have three questions each that are going to be submitted by the chat. This is where you guys get to get involved. Um, each team is going to have three questions that we will be asking him. I will be picking the questions. So when we get toward the end of the uh, toward the end of the debate, to that part of the debate, I will be asking you guys to put your questions up so that we can draw from that. And then after that, we'll have closing arguments. <clears throat> and uh, again, that'll be 10 minutes each. And that will pretty much be the end of the debate. So now the rules, the rules go as such. We just want to be respectful. Everybody is here. We're all Christians. Like, hey, let's just walk in the fruit of the spirit. That's what we need to do, brothers. I know, I know you brothers. I've been spending a little bit of time with you. I know you guys are passionate about, the, about this, this topic here. We all are. So I just want to say just be respectful to each other and just, just go to each other in love. That's all I would ask. Uh, and then the, the, the time limits are going to be strict, strictly enforced. Uh, no personal attacks, guys. Don't, don't, it's not nothing personal. If you, you, can do, do, you can disagree with someone without being disagreeable. And also, uh, chat, I, I would ask you guys to conduct yourself well in the chat in the, with the same decorum, the same respect, the same love, the same fruit of the spirit, because I believe everybody here in the chat is Christian as well. So we want to walk in the spirit, guys. So we're going to have equal time. <clears throat> that way, um, it is a um, a neutral debate. Everybody is, gets the same amount of time to say what they have to say. So um, and <clears throat> that's pretty much it. What I would like to do at this time is I would like to pray before we go in here. So if everybody with the bowed, bowed heads, please, Father, in Jesus' name, we thank you. We praise you. We love you. Lord, we thank you for the opportunity, Lord God, to open up your word, Lord God, and to come to your throne, Lord God, and to come before these men and women that have come, Lord God, to share your word, Lord God. And even though there may be some disagreements, we just ask that you, Lord, that, that you would reign, Lord God, that your love would reign, Lord God, your word would reign supreme, Lord God, and the truth will reign supreme, Lord God. So we ask that you manage our conduct, Lord God, and keep us focused on what is good and what is true. Lord, we love you, and we thank you, we praise you for what you're going to do. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Praise God. So, <clears throat> so we, let's see, we we determined that uh, that uh, Travis is going to open up with the first opening statement. Is that correct, gentlemen? That's what we have in the notes, right. I think. Yep. Yep. Yes. Okay. Okay, so let's see. Um, so, 10 minutes. So you guys got your 10 minutes it's right 20. here. Oh, 20, 20. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay. Right, right. Let me go ahead and make one. Yeah, that's sorry. No Everyone's problem. gonna have to listen to me for 20. It's 20 minutes. <laughs> he says sorry. <laughs> okay. So um, so Travis, okay, so your 20 minutes starts when you, and then remember we're gonna we're gonna have a warning. Two minute warning. That's your two minute warning. I know Jason, we, I'll have to, because he's having audio audio problem here, we'll go ahead, I'll go ahead and say two minutes anyway, but the rest of you will already know. So, Okay. Okay, so That's fine. with that. You want to share my screen? Oh, okay, hold on. Okay, did you put it? Oh, here it is. You've already put it up there. I see it. Yeah. Up here. Okay. Okay. All right. So, starting my timer too. Okay. Gotcha. 